Hello. Hi. I am Diane Ryan from Prairie Village, Kansas. This is the fourth year I've attended the stockholder meeting, and I'd like to say every year I feel like I've learned a little bit more. This year my question is, do you see a deflationary trend in the global economy? And if so, what is your investment advice? Well, Diane, I, um, I'm no good on the macro questions, and I've proven that by being way too worried about inflation for probably the last 20 years. Fortunately, it hasn't made much difference, uh, the fact that I've been wrong on that. Uh, so I don't really think my judgment is any better than yours at all in terms of assessing what's going to happen to global prices over time. My, my opinion would be that the world is not going into any deflationary uh, situation. But, you know, I, I've, not, I've not earned any, uh, any uh, stars for my past economic predictions. And the good thing about my economic predictions, if I even do make them, is that I pay no attention to them myself. So uh, I, I really, uh, and the way we pick our investments is we just don't get into the macro factors. I can't recall a time when Charlie and I have looked at a business, either buying it in its entirety or buying uh, pieces of it through the stock market. I just, macro uh, conclusions are just never, never enter into the discussion. I mean, you know, I'll pick up the phone. We've had these two in recent months and I'll tell Charlie about it. And, you know, we, we talk about a few things, but we don't talk about anything remotely macro uh, and and that's really the way it'll stay you know I, I I've seen a lot of bank mergers recently and one of the things they do because they want to cut the costs and, and justify a merger which they're dying to do I mean that's the reason they they so they they cut costs they wouldn't have cut if they if they weren't dying to do the merger in the first place and get bigger but they frequently I know one in particular that I'm thinking of that you know they'll cut out the economics department you know I always wonder why the hell they had it in the first place you know because what what do, they, what do they do? You know, I mean, the guy comes in, I says, I think GDP will be 4.6 this year instead of 4.3. So what? You know, I mean, you're still trying to make every good loan you can make, and you're still trying to take in deposits. And you should be trying to cut costs wherever you can. It's got nothing to do with running the business. But, but you know, it, it's, it's fashionable. And every bank had its economist and economics department, and when a big client would come in, they take them to lunch. And it just, it always has struck me as, it's just a lot of nonsense, uh, you know. So if we ever get a economics department at Berkshire, sell the stock short. <laughs> Number six, please. No, Charlie, I didn't. No, no, okay. He'd rather eat peanut brittle. 